So imagine having an AI assistant that creates content for you 24 seven. Well, I've just cracked the code and I'm about to show you how. In the next 10 minutes, you'll learn how to build your own AI content machine with no coding experience at all. And it's like having a tireless content creator at your fingertips. First of all, I'll walk you through a demo of the agent I built and then show you how to create your own. Use this YouTube video and write me blog post along with a newsletter email. And then I'm gonna paste this YouTube video. I'm actually pulling from this YouTube video of mine explaining how to make money with no code software building platforms in 2025. And it's essentially gonna take this transcript, search the internet based on that, and then kind of provide us with an output of a professionally crafted newsletter and blog post. All right, with that being said, let's get right into it. I wanna show you this in action. So we have our AI content generator, Lindy, up here. It's an AI agent that builds and repurposes content for us on autopilot. So here's the flow editor. I'm gonna walk you through how to do all this in a bit. It's really simple to do, but here is the prompt. I'm gonna say, take this video and turn it into repurposed content for me. And if I click this, it's a YouTube video I made on how to make money with no code SaaS building platforms, really informative. So I wanna make a blog post and a newsletter post. And as you can see, it's going through step by step. So it's transcribing the video. This is the first step in our workflow. Then it is going to a conditional step. And this basically won't move on to the next step unless it has sufficient information in order to write the blog post and the newsletter. All right, while this is loading, there's actually another step inside of the AI agent where it will not only read this transcript of the video, but it will search the internet based on the context of the video and get more information about the different stuff I'm talking about in the video. And that is what this sufficient information step is. So once it gets enough information from the internet, as well as my video to write a blog post, it'll move on to the create document step. And as you can see, it created a document titled AI for non-techies, leveraging no code AI platforms in 2025. That is what the video is about. It actually adds a link to the Google document that it writes for us. So here's the blog post, AI for non-techies. That's awesome. And if we scroll down a bit more, we have a full newsletter post as well that I could copy paste and then post to my newsletter along with the fact that we could actually automatically make this send email out to my email list. But for the sake of this video, I didn't wanna you know, add that action here, but this is awesome. We have repurposed content simply from a video and that only took us like five seconds of pasting in a link. All right, so first of all, obviously we want to sign up with Lindy AI. If you don't already have an account, make sure to sign up. I'm now inside of the platform and I wanna come over to the left-hand side and click new Lindy. Then go ahead and click start from scratch. Lindy AI, real quickly, is essentially a platform that gives you utility to build AI agents. So we could build AI agents in any creative way that we could think of. And in this video, I'm gonna show you a pretty cool use case. So first of all, we need to select a trigger. This is what is actually going to trigger our assistant to then you know, speak with us. So we need to go to chat and click message received. And then from there, what we're gonna do is we are going to then click perform an action and type in transcribe video. So essentially what we're gonna do is we're gonna be able to pull information from a YouTube video that we add, and it's going to extract the transcript. And then basically we're gonna create an AI step of this where we're gonna tell it to use that transcript and build a blog post and a newsletter post based on that video. So essentially we could repurpose our YouTube videos across different platforms and we could structure the AI to work however we want to, but let's go ahead and do this real quickly. So real quick, if you're not already subscribed, subscribe to the YouTube channel. This channel is AI for non-techies. So if you want to learn all about AI, but aren't a technical person, this channel is perfect for you. So make sure to like the video and subscribe it means a lot. What we could do is we could actually choose the AI model that that transcribes this. The best I've found is Claude 3.5 Sonnet, so I'm gonna leave it with the default, and then let's just leave this as auto. Move on from here. What we want to do then is we want to add an AI agent here. What we have to do is we actually have to prompt this. So this is where we want to kind of give instructions for our AI assistant. How do we want it to act? This is the important part right here to get our AI to function properly and to do research on this video and then craft a professional blog with it. So here is my prompt. You are a professional copywriter and there's gonna be two tasks. So task number one is we are going to be providing a blog post based on the video transcript that you will be provided. First, find extra information online to make it more complete and informational. And then for the voice, use Sean Purry, a bit toned down, which is somebody that actually has their own blog and he makes really good AI tech 
content. So we're gonna use his voice, try to make it in the frame, try to make it sound like he wrote this. And article length, we want to limit it to 800 words. All right, so for task number two, then create a newsletter to send out to my community of AI enthusiasts that are non-techies and want to learn about AI and then add two sections in the Google Doc. So one section labeled blog post and the other labeled newsletter. So after we take this prompt, we are then going to have this, do the research and write the blog post and the newsletter for us and then add it to a Google document so we could copy and paste it and actually go ahead and post it. In this AI agents tab, we, if you come down to the very bottom, there is this thing called skills. And these are different actions that we could train our AI agent to do. So let me show you a quick example. So we could come here and let's just say browse the internet. So it could actually go ahead and search the internet. So I prompted the AI to take any information from the transcript and then write a blog post based on that. But I also prompted it to search the web for any other information in order to make the blog post better. And so what I need to do is I need to then add this action here where I give it this tool and this skill to actually go ahead and do that. Another thing, I mean, there's multiple ways, I mean, there's tons of different things we could add here. You could get really particular or give it the ability to delete emails. You could have it send emails, all of these things. Think of the skills as the certain actions that your AI agent can make inside of Lindy AI. It's really cool. All right, so inside of the AI agent, we actually need to add an exit condition step. So essentially, this will only exit this step of our workflow if this is complete. So what we could say is exit once you have sufficient information. So that way it won't exit this step until it has enough information to actually write a professional blog article and newsletter. So once that is set up, it's good to go. And we need to go to our next step, which is going to be to create a document, go to Google Docs, and we then need to sign into our Google account, which I already did here. Model, we're gonna use Claude 3.5 Sonnet just cause it's best and we could add it to a certain folder if we want to. And I'm gonna have this auto title and auto make the content. All right, so we want to come to our next step. We want to perform an action, click chat, and then click send message. And what we will do is let's click prompt AI. And then I wrote this prompt here. Basically it says send the message with the link from the new Google doc and then Basically, you wanna map this field here, go down to create document and then URL. So then it'll actually paste that document that I actually made inside of this message box. Click save and then we could actually test this out and see if it's working. In order to test this, we wanna to come to tasks. All right, first of all, we need to save it, then come to tasks and create a new task. And now what we wanna do is we wanna actually interact with our Lindy that we created. So I'm gonna say, use this YouTube video and write me blog post along with a newsletter email. And then I'm gonna paste this YouTube video. I'm actually pulling from this YouTube video of mine, explaining how to make money with no code software building platforms in 2025. And it's essentially gonna take this transcript, search the internet based on that, and then kind of provide us with an output of a professionally crafted newsletter and blog post. Inside of this task tab here, you could actually see it doing each of these steps. You could see the transcribed video. And once it did that, it is now moving on to the conditional step where it's making sure it has sufficient information before moving on. So it looks like it actually created a document that took about 30 seconds. Let's go ahead and click on the document to see what it made us. So here's the first blog post. The blog post is titled AI for non-techies, revolutionizing software development. This looks pretty good it's in a good tone of voice it looks very well kind of scripted that's amazing and then if we come down a bit more you could actually see the newsletter so same thing um, it shows the subject and then it has the context of the email the no code AI revolution what this means for you democratized development rapid prototyping cost-effective innovation all of this is stuff that I go over in that video so it transcribed so it took the transcript of that video and scraped it perfectly I, I think this performed really, really well. And we could get really creative with how we do this. We could even then add another step in our Lindy and have it actually create and send out 
our newsletter for us automatically without having to do anything. All right, there we go. We built a full AI content generating system under 10 minutes. Hopefully this completely revolutionizes the way that you write your content and scales your outputs of the amount of content you're able to put out there onto the internet because content will completely change your life if you do it correctly. It has for me. So if you guys could leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube video, that would mean the world. Feel free to sign up with Lindy in the description. There is a link there. So I'll see you guys in the next video.